Good evening. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Hi, teacher. Good evening. Hello. How are you? How are you Bye. doing? Fine. Everybody's fine. Everybody's okay. I'm so good. <laughs> Not so good. Why? No, I I so good. Ah, I'm so good. <laughs> I'm so good. Okay, great. I was wondering what happened. Why not so good? No, but I'm so good. It's great. Right. So good. Yes. So far, so good. Nice. Are you ready for class? Yes. Did you I'm have ready. Did you have dinner? Yes. Okay. Did you drink coffee? Yes. <laughs> I, want, I want to drink coffee. <laughs> All right. How many cups of coffee? Um, All day. Three? Three cups All of day. coffee. All day. No, four. Four cups, Four of, cups coffee. of coffee during the whole day. Yes. Mm. One in the breakfast at the arrived at the office mm -hmm. in the afternoon. Mm -hmm. uh, and when when I in dinner? When I came home. When I came home. Mm -hmm. All right. Mm. Good numbers. <laughs> Good I like, numbers. I, I like the coffee. I like coffee very much. Yes. Yes, me too. Coffee is great. When you are tired, when you need energy, you get some coffee and you feel better. And you can continue yes. working. Yes, true. The same here. I think I have three cups of coffee today. When I was going to the office, I, I usually drink coffee when I'm driving. It's because I need to wake up. <laughs> I usually have my mug. It's something like, you know, sipping from time to time on the traffic light. So I get coffee like half morning and half afternoon. So it's like three cups of coffee like the break in the morning at 9 9 30 and the break in the afternoon at three so i usually have three cups of coffee all right daniel Tejo. How, Hello, about, how about your day good evening how was your day um in the ending of day <laughs> have an emergency Emergency. You had an right? emergency. What happened? Um, I going to Sonsonate in one hour. Um, what? <laughs> yeah. Um, I re re return. Returned the check of fifty thousand dollars. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. Uh, um, you <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, fast and furious. Fast and furious. In one hour. Yes. And later I go into my office and take my computer. And continue um, working. Yeah. <laughs> oh wow, but that was incredible. Yes. Unbelievable. Yeah, I, I don't imagine myself driving an hour <laughs> to go to San Yeah. My God. Oh wow. Okay. I saw Julio going home probably walking. I see Karen, I see Daniela, Dolores. Oh, well, Dolores says she's going to be listening. Dolores. Uh -huh. I see Juliana, who's also uh, here today. Okay. Karen, Karen, what about you? How was your day? What did you do today? 
<laughs> All good. The normal, the yeah. usual, the routine. Tranquila. <laughs> Relax. Okay, Relax. nice. What time do you start work? What time do you finish? What time? What time do you start work and what time do you finish work? And seven. I start seven at seven, uh -huh. and I finish. We finish and four. At four. Okay, good. Yeah, from seven to four. That's great. Yeah. Every day. Every day. Um, yeah. Do you work on Saturdays? Um, seven. Um, start seven in um in eleven from seven to eleven on Saturday. Oh wow! Yeah. You're so lucky. <laughs> That's a good schedule. True. Yeah. True. Yeah. True. True. Okay. Everybody finish the platform, section one, unit one, all the exercises? Yes, teacher. Yes, good. I see. If you need to work on it, you gotta work on it, okay? Okay, let's have the attendance before anything else happened. Today is? Wednesday, first, February 1st. February 1st. Oh no, January is gone, 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 gone. Ya se fue. Ana Ruth, Brenda Lisset, Claudia Patricia, Daniela Donay, Daniel Alejandro, Daniela Tatiana, Ah, no, Daniela Lisset, I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. Oh, my goodness. Oh, no, what happened with the attendance? Daniela is not here. Daisy. Daisy Tatiana. Dolores. Juliana. Present teacher. Hi. Haley. Jonas. Jorge. Jose David. Julio. Present, present. Hello. Karen. Present. Kevin. Kevin is not here yet. Must be driving or really busy. Lady? Lady Maricela? Not yet. Present. Hi. <laughs> Great. Ruth Evelyn. Present. The most punctual one. <laughs> <laughs> the only one. The one and only. Okay. Helen says present on the chat. Thank you, Helen. And Dolores as well. All right. Teacher, hey. present. <laughs> Sorry. You were talking. Yeah. Yeah, it's all right. I saw you. So I got the present. Yes. Uh huh. But Daniel Alejandro, no llegado. Bueno, not yet. True, true, true. Okie dokie. Oh my god. <laughs> let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Okay, what we have for today's class. If you hear this uh, dog screaming, it's because my neighbor's dog is very, very weird. All right, so this is our class number six. We start the unit two tonight. Yay! 
claps. <laughs> On virtual classes, we go like claps. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so this is Wednesday, February the 1st. This is the month of love. <laughs> we start the shortest month of the year, probably. We have only 28 days, right? So we get started. Yeah, let's go on. Hmm, this is nice and interesting. Okay, so these are the reminders about the class. And definitely the reminders about the, the conference. And at the end of this session, participants will be able to describe activities and events in the workplace and other environments and the identify the use of adverse of frequency so we continue talking about our work okay <laughs> we're not going to talk about vacations or hobbies or relaxing activities it's still about the work but now we're going to incorporate the adverse of frequency probably it's something that you are a little bit familiar with so it's not totally new you use the adverse of frequencies when you speak so you say always, never, sometimes, usually. So those are the adverse of frequency, okay? And we use them in the sentences to describe habits, routines, and well, activities uh, that we usually do or are repeated in a frequency of time, of course, right? So this is what we are going to do basically on this class, right? And the first thing, yay, <laughs> talk about the frequency that you do the following activities at work. These are only two examples, check social media, drink coffee. So the frequency in which you do this activity, say, oh, I never check social media at work, or I sometimes check social media at work, or I always check social media at work when my boss is not looking at me. <laughs> you say, mm, I rarely, I never, or almost never check social media. Or I usually check social media, but I always drink coffee in the morning, in the afternoon, all the time. Okay. Well, no, I never drink coffee in the morning, or I never drink coffee at work. What other activities uh, can you ask about? the frequency for example other activities that probably uh, receive personal phone calls probably people don't say that's part of your work yes or download music now you don't need to do that or make reservation some people are at work supposedly <laughs> and they are making reservations for their trips or vacations for hotels or for restaurants, or buying tickets for the movie, or shopping online. Ajá, ese tipo de cosas que la gente hace pero que no son parte de su trabajo. Yes? Ah, vamos a descubrir verdades aquí. <ríe> ok, ¿qué otras podrían agregar? Escríbanlas en el chat. Yo les he agregado two, two examples. Check social media, drink coffee, podría ser shop online, receive personal calls, make reservations, buy movie tickets, download music or movies. Vamos a ver qué otras nos sugieren. Ok, vacations. Mm -hmm. No. Yeah, but <laughs> never take vacations. So let's create a muy activity like reserve for vacation, reserve a hotel for vacation. Cosas que no deberían estar haciendo. Prepare reports si es parte de su trabajo, pero cosas que no deberían estar haciendo at work. Que las están haciendo y la gente piensa que ustedes están trabajando. <laughs> Talk on the phone, chat on WhatsApp, exactly, ver memes, <laughs> share these videos, watch memes, uh -huh. chat, exactly. What else? 
stalking people, <laughs> drink coffee and bread. Ah, that's another one. Tener un montón de snacks ahí en la, en la, en la gaveta, ¿verdad? Start eating all the time, okay? <laughs> Chips. Listen to music, checking WhatsApp, right? Uh -huh. Ajá. I see the series in, in the computer. Listening to music, googleando, start googling, cosas de su interés, right? <laughs> or doing the children's homework. Hay mamás que les están haciendo la tarea a los children ahí, le están mandando hasta las impresiones y cosas. Yo... <laughs> What happens? <laughs> okay. Shopping online. Sí, hay gente que hace un gran montón de shopping online while working. Eating. Listening to music on WhatsApp. Uh -huh. Esas son como las más cómodas. ¿Qué otras podrían ser? Watching movies or watching videos. Sometimes. Uh -huh. Listening to music. Uh -huh. <laughs> Doing homework. <laughs> But si es de inglés no hay problema. <laughs> Completing the platform. <laughs> okay. Uh, what else? What else? Shopping from the supermarket online. Comprando los mandados para pasarlo a recoger después. Okay. Uh -huh. Making or singing with my friend. <laughs> Practicing with Duolingo. <laughs> Ok, ya, yeah, yo he hecho eso. <laughs> Practicing vocabulary on Duolingo. Uh -huh. Buscando ideas de decoration for the house. <laughs> I know, some people do that. Oh. How do you call it? Ay, ¿Cómo que se llama este website? ¿Dónde sale un montón de ideas? I forgot. Pinterest. Pinterest, that's right. A <laughs> bien que sabe, ¿verdad, Daniel? <laughs> I do that. Shopping at chain. Uh -huh. What else? What else? Searching places for parties. <laughs> uh -huh. Alibaba. Pero se puede comprar desde aquí en Alibaba. Como chain, se lo traen. O como Amazon. Yes, but the Chinese person is very bad. It's dangerous, right? Yeah, it's dangerous. Yo compro en Alibaba y en y en y en 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 chain. AliExpress y llega a Estados Unidos y de Estados Unidos me lo traen. Ah, bueno, ah, that's different. <laughs> Porque paying para que lo traigan a El Salvador más caro el, el shipping que el que el product. <laughs> yes. Y paga mucho. No. El to, the pez, to the United States is normal. Sí. Delivery price. Pero ajá, hay ahí alguien que venga ver, conocido. Y con el papeleo y todo eso. Eh, tengo que enviarle el, el, la foto de la compra a la viajera. Mm. Okay. Okay. Tips aquí. Tips with Juliana. <laughs> <laughs> okay, listening and singing to music, lyrics. If it's in English and you are learning English, it's okay. <laughs> Doing your child's homework. Uh -huh. He visto eso. Teacher, otra cosa que yo hago es hacer, eh, pero no sé cómo decirlo, eh, eh, trabajos que, que me salen por fuera, los, los trabajos en la oficina. <laughs> No van a ver la grabación, ¿verdad? No, no, no. Es como personal work. Ah, uh, personal mm -hmm. work. Or, yeah, sí, es personal work or your own business completing reports. Iguanitas. Iguanitas, dice Dolores. ¿Y qué es Iguanita? ¿A qué se refiere, Dolores? Iguanitas es... When you do other work, uh, other tasks in uh, your work, uh -huh, in your work, but you obtain a pay. Ah, payment. So it's like uh -huh. your business. 
Exacto. Mm -hmm. Yes. Looking for places. Fuera, fuera de... <laughs> Aprovechando el internet. Ok, searching for places for parties, dice acá. Va, ahí tienen un montón de opciones. Recuérdenlas y pregúntenle a su partner. How often do you? <laughs> o oh, ustedes pues igual pueden comentar, ¿verdad? I never do this. I always do this. Examples? ¿Cuál podría ser un example? Uh -huh. Escribir un ejemplo por acá. A ver. Mm, acá. Para el caso. I always drink coffee at work. Yo todo el tiempo estoy tomando coffee. Pues another example could be I never ¿Qué es algo de estas cosas que dijeron en el chat que nunca hago? I never make reservations. Reservations for vacations. For vacations or the weekend. Yeah. Hay personas que sí lo hacen, pero I don't do that. Empezar, I don't go on vacation. <risa> so, eso es como contar, pero ya usando un adverbio frequency. ¿Con qué frecuencia hago este tipo de cosas? ¿Ya? ¿Está claro? ¿Está clear? Yes. Yeah. All right. Vale. Pero cuéntenle, pues así es sincerarse todo el mundo con sus partners. No en estar quiet. Everybody should be honest and sincere. Let's see. Well, actually, no pone. Yes. For partners. Eh, sí, ahí entendí que uh, dice talk about the frequency do you, you do the following activities at work check such a fee las que se hacen y las que no se hacen okay. las escribimos primero ajá, yo digo que sí vale, ok no me acuerdo cuál es Listen to music at work. Be and sometimes I do homework. <laughs> I 
yo um, I often check. No, I often check WhatsApp. Um, okay. I always no, I always no. I sometimes dress. So, what is the frequency? Eh, that that no more, that no mucho, no muchas veces. Pero tampoco sometimes. Sometimes es como que algunas veces. A veces. Uh -huh. A veces. Ah, pues sometimes I make two calls, two calls. Eh, personal calls uh -huh. llamadas personales ok yo a veces salgo a veces. Eh, I sometimes live, no, I sometimes live after the agency. Yo a veces salgo luego de la agencia. I sometimes, se escribe el ave. Ajá, live. After the, the agency. And also in the weekend, yeah. And the second activity, I usually drink coffee in the evening because I don't sleep better, right? And the three is I never take vacation or, or I never receive vacation in the work, yeah. This is all. And the next is Lady. Yo no hago nada malo en el trabajo. Ah, son actividades malas. O sea, fuera de, de lo común que tuviese que hacer en el trabajo. Mm. What did you work, Lady? Um... Usually coffee, Monday, and <laughs> Um, the theme to music every day. Eh, uh, here, come, como todo el día. <laughs> <laughs> No sé, no sé qué más. El chat WhatsApp. Quizás es lo que más hago. <laughs> yeah, three activities. All right, next. Tu turno, George. Jorge. Ay, yo. <laughs> Fíjense que precisamente ahorita le estoy despidiendo al jefe. <laughs> me, pasa, me olvidó reportar algo. <laughs> A ver, eh, una actividad okay. No, que siga mejor Juliana, después voy yo. <ríe> ok. Eh, my activity in the world usually eh, check email every day. Number two. Eh, Drink, drink, drink the coffee in the afternoon every day, every day. <laughs> uh, number three, um, 
listen to music, eh, my parents, compañeros, parents, ¿verdad? Partners. Partners. My partners, Julio. Um, every day. Eh, pone música. Music. ¿Cómo lo diría? Listen to music. Sí, yo la escucho, música? pero él la, él la pone, pero yo la escucho. <risa> <risa> Ella pone para toda la oficina. <risa> eh, correcto. He plays music. He plays he music. He plays music, yes. Ok. Your, tu turno, Jorge. <risa> según, según entendí, son actividades. Son actividades que como que no deberíamos de hacer en el trabajo, ¿eh? Exacto. O que no están dentro de actividades comunes. O que son prohibidas. ¿va? Pues prohibidas no, porque a mí nadie me dijo que no podía escuchar música. ¿Cómo? Prohibidas no, porque a mí nadie me dijo que no podía escuchar música. ¿va? Ah, a mí sí. No está dentro de mis actividades, pero nadie me dijo que no. Vaya, aquí ya puse. Quiero ver. A ver si me entienden. Bueno, ya saben que soy instructor. ¿verdad? La primera, eh, I usually give students more time than they show in their class. Clases. No sé si me entendieron. Daniel, que es el más el experto ahí, me entendiste. Tenés el micrófono apagado. Please, please. Vaya. <risa> Dice. I usually, actualmente, give students more time I never drink coffee at work. Excuse I me. check. Come. I never. What? I never drink coffee at work. <gasps> Why? <laughs> <laughs> no. Um. I don't like. My God. It's a first person. <laughs> a first person. <laughs> <laughs> okay, next. <laughs> okay. I check my WhatsApp from time to time. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I never watch TV at work. At lunch, I almost always watch Netflix on my phone. Me too. <laughs> <laughs> Every Friday, mm -hmm. every Friday, ask cake, and because we like cake and it has become custom money, custom money with my companions, we bought it. Mm. O sea, comemos pastel todos los viernes porque se ha hecho costumbre. Ah, <laughs> oh, mire pues. Uh, I uh, I watch series of Netflix usually at um, a half half. ¿Cómo se dice mediodía? No. Middle day. Middle day. Uh -huh. yes. Pero como me quedo picada, no, no lo hago. <laughs> <laughs> I I always take a five minutes to prepare my schedule. Uh, I occasionally visit the insurance company. I normally live at the office at eight o'clock. Um, Sometimes have a meeting with my boss. And I often talk to the insurance company analysts. Okay, para allá y para acá. 
Sí, a veces me toca ir a las compañías de seguro. Generalmente, general, eh, usually, sometime, uh, una vez por mes. Um, once, a, once a month. In a month. In, once in a month. Um, está bien. <ríe> no sé si Julio habrá terminado. Maybe not. Okay, volunteers, to confess, <laughs> Evelyn, <laughs> go ahead. Uh, I say that I always take a five minute to prepare a schedule in the morning, and I normally leave at the office at eight at eight o'clock. I sometimes have a meeting with my boss in your office. In his office. And in his office, and I often talk to the insurance company analysts. All right, nice. Normally once a month. That's great. Very efficient. <laughs> Exactly. Okay, Daniel. <laughs> Hello. Confess your pecados. <laughs> your sins. <laughs> All right. In my work, I usually eat, um, for example, fruit. The snacks. The snacks. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And my partner, uh, Juliana, <laughs> say in the world, don't have permission of drinking. <laughs> yeah. And, and you're like, ah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And Please. She always drink coffee. <laughs> yeah. All right. Lady. Oh, my girl at usually listening to music or they <laughs> eat the um, caramelo? Candy. Candy. I'll always eat, eat candy. candy. <laughs> <laughs> and chocolates. <laughs> and snacks. Eat person girl. <laughs> Getting showy. <laughs> All right, Karen. Karen was raising her hand. Yeah. Um, I always listen to music at work. I often check WhatsApp. <laughs> and I never must work. Um, um, and sometimes a little after the hands. All right, nice. Okay. Jorge. Sí. Eh, una actividad mía, ¿no? Actividades que hace, que debería, que no debería hacer. <ríe> y la frecuencia con la que la hace. Ah, pues, la, voy a decir una. Que la hago muy frecuentemente. Uh -huh. I usually give students more time than they should in their class. Okay, usually study at work. Perdón. You usually study at work. 
study, estudiando. Study, estudiando. Uh -huh. Or practice English. Ay, <ríe> que me cuesta entenderlo. Usualmente está estudiando en su trabajo. No, no, no. El tiempo que doy a los alumnos. Ah, teach. Uh, you usually give extra time in the classes. Ah. Doy más del debido, más de lo debido, pues. Y eso no le afecta, no tiene así como cada hora una clase con alguien diferente. Sí. Pero, Ajá, entonces el, el siguiente tiene que esperar. Eh, no, porque juego solo con 10 minutos más o menos. Ok, all right. So you usually give extra time in the class. Ok. ¿Alguna experience teaching driving? Ayer. ¿Qué le pasó? Accident. No, qué va. No, ¿cómo se llama? Hay que expresarme en inglés. No tengo mucho vocabulario. Tenía un, un student who speaks English. No, no, no. No, es respecto a lo que me, lo que acabo de decir sobre, sobre el tiempo. Mm. Me pidió más tiempo de lo que pues, es asignado. Uh -huh. Tuve que, que darlo, pero obviamente no, no, no puedo. No debería, ajá. No le dijo usted eh. next class. Y entonces, ajá, sí, sí lo dije, pero bueno, no comprende. La, hay gente que no comprende. Ah, bien, bien extraño, ¿verdad? Porque, o sea... Sentido común, al parecer, pues. Ajá. Al parecer creo que le compraron las clases. Él no firmó el contrato. No sabía las condiciones. Uh -huh. O pero, hay gente que la firma, pero igual no la lee. <ríe> so they don't know. They ignore the information. Pero es sentido pero, común. O sea, el hecho de que vea que usted está haciendo su trabajo y que seguramente le han calendarizado cada hora. With someone different. Uh -huh. Para gente que no comprende el servicio al cliente, así es. Interesante, porque yo pagué lessons, o sea, cuando yo aprendí a manejar, yo, yo obviamente pagué clases de manejo y yo sabía que el instructor estaba una hora nada más. Y así, ¿verdad? igual yo me tenía que ir también porque justo había pedido para, mí, para ir a las driving lessons antes de irme a mi trabajo. Y tenía que ir con el tiempo también. People, ¿verdad? Ok, Juliana. <ríe> Okay, my my parents, lady, drink coffee and listen to music in the work. Oh. <laughs> Your co-worker, lady. <laughs> Daniel checks this is his mail. Jorge tour on the air condition in the car really? when he when he is hot <laughs> when the only, weather is hot <laughs> only only okay bye usted vino de la tarde sus partners <laughs> and you <laughs> and me uh, i drink coffee all the uh, time and eat bread every day Okay. But it, usually every day. Uh, <laughs> in the afternoon. In the afternoon. Okay, nice. Thank you. Good job. Dolores dice, sometimes I look for information for my son's homework. <laughs> Dolores está haciendo homework en su hijo ahí. And Julio. Hi, Tisha. Hi. Uh, can you algo agregando ahí a, a Yuli? Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, in my office, all people uh, drink coffee every day. Mm -hmm. um, I check my email. I check my With email. With me? Ah, yeah. Sorry? Drink coffee with me? <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I check my email every day because I wait for a good news. Um, I usually call to the clients one day per week. In my work, I usually play music on Spotify. And everybody's um, happy at the office. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. um, okay. Y aparte, un, otro, aparte de un negocito que tengo, podría decir que uh, I love the graphic design. Oh, nice. So you are 
watching videos about graphic design? Um, um, or designing? Tomé, tomé, sí, tomé, tomé cursos y de hecho, eh, cuando comencé mi negocito, mm. todo era en base a, a videos. Mm. A, entonces, eso realmente eso ayuda, el curso ayuda bastante pero realmente ayuda más la práctica. Right. Y, y a través de videos sí se aprende bastante. Yes. Realmente se aprende mucho. Definitely. Thank you. Uh, thank you, teacher. All right. No me he escuchado a Daniela ni a Karen. Voy a escuchar más a Karen. Ajá. Uh -huh. Y es tú, ese Karen. Ya pasé. Ya estuvo, ah, pues a Daniela. Ok, voy yo. Voy yo. Okay. My turn, my turn. I never drink coffee at work. I check my WhatsApp from time to time. I never watch TV at work. Mm, at lunch, I almost always watch Netflix on my phone. Every Friday, as cupcake because we like cupcake and it has become custom customary. It has become my, a custom, a tradition. With my, <laughs> With my companions, we bought it. You buy cakes or cupcakes. Okay. With your co-workers, with your colleagues. Mm -hmm. Yes. All right, nice. Great. Daniel Alejandro, good evening. Welcome. Good evening. Thank How you. How are you? All right. All right. Like coffee with bread. Excuse me? Without bread, no coffee. <laughs> okay, without bread, no coffee. All right. Breakfast without coffee is no breakfast. Okay. Yes. That's all right. Thanks. Okay. Ya son algunas de las cosillas, ¿verdad? Para introducir el... To introduce the topic of the adverse of frequency. Ok. Obviously, el manual les presentaba algunas little questions. How often do you check your email at work? We all do that, like all the time, right? How often do you attend meetings? Entonces, cuando queremos preguntar con qué frecuencia es algo, decimos how often, right? So we're gonna practice the conversation. John and Anna. John says, how often do you check your email? Every two hours, and you? Well, I try to check it as often as I can. And how often do you call your clients? I often call them once a week on Monday, but I usually call them on Friday to check their order. Do you call clients? Yes, I always call them first thing in the morning. I believe it is important to have contact with them all the time. You're right. Once again, <clears throat> how often do you check your email? Every two hours. And you? Well, I try to check it as often as I can. And how often do you call your clients? I often call them once a week on Monday. But I usually call them on Friday to check their orders. Do you call clients? Yes, I always call them first thing in the morning. I believe it is important to have contact with them all the time. You are right. You're right. Bye. Voy a dar un minuto para que lo lean, escaneen toda la conversation y vean si hay alguna dificultad, any difficulty with uh, pronunciation or with the vocabulary. Y me la pueden hacer a la consulta right now. Okay? Vean. Check, check, check.
Ok, ¿hay alguna consulta? ¿Y es Julio? Eh, no, 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 estaba anotándome para ir en... <risa> van a leer, perdón. No, 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 it's ok, it's ok, don't Gracias. worry. No, pero si tiene alguna consulta, it's fine. Eh, no, no, de momento no. Perfect. Quizás me equivoque, pero ya veremos en su momento. Gracias. All right, perfect, no problem. Anybody else? Mm. Yes, Daniel. Try. From? Uh, yo will try to check. I try, I try to check. Okay, intento, trato de chequear. Yes, I try to check it as often as I can. Tan a menudo como pueda. Mm -hmm. Something else? No more. Okay. So we're going to practice with our partners. Let's see. Vamos a cambiar de grupos. So we're going to practice more. And when we come back, yes, we're going to do it for the whole class. Oh, you say yo. Yo, you say yo. Oh. Okay. Or do you Every two hours. And you? We. Oui. I try to check in a often as I Come. I come. A how often do you card you credit? I often call they on a week on Monday, but I usually call they on Friday to check their order. Do you call clients? Yes, I order card the fridge three in the morning. I every it is important to have contact with the on the track. You are right. <laughs> How often do you check your email? Mm -hmm. Every two hours. And you? Well, I try to check it as often as I can. And how often do you call your clients? I often call them on say a week on Monday, but usually call. Then on Friday to check their order. Do you call client? Yes, I always call them first thing in the morning. I believe it is important to have contact with them all the time. You are right. Good. Okay. Vaya, hoy yo sería John. Mm -hmm. Okay. Y Daniel sería Anne. Okay. Hey, how often do you check your email? Every, Every two hours, hours and you. 
<risa> Sorry, ¿cuál, de, ¿cuál Daniel? Eh, tú, tú porque ah. ya Daniel participó con los dos personajes. A ti te, tú comenzaste con John, pero te falta el de Anne. All Repetime. Right. Good, good. Okay, okay repeat. Uh, how often do you check your email? Every two hours. And you? Uh, well, I try to check if... Uh, I try to... Uh, perdón. Well, I try to check it as often as I can. And how often do you call your clients? I often call them once a week on Monday. But I usually call... 10 on Friday to check their order. Do you call clients? Yes. I always, I always call them first. I, pardon, pardon, me trajo todo. Yes. I always, I always call them first thing in the morning. I believe it is important to have contact with them all the time. You are right. Chévere. Entonces, vaya, ahí ya queda para que veamos qué onda, porque ya participamos todos y solo me tenemos ahí acá. Uh, no, me pues estamos los tres. Eh, eh, yo me, yo me ubiqué, sí, yo me eh, ubiqué, bueno, no sé qué me pasó. Ubicismo, no sé. En la última frase de John, donde dice, yes, hay algo. La como, aquí suena como all the time. Yes, all the I, time. yes, I always call them first thing in the morning. I believe it's I believe it is important to have contact with them all the time. Mm -hmm. Am I right? <laughs> Lo voy a repetir. Okay, okay, okay. Yes, I always call them first thing in the morning. I believe it is important to have contact with them all the time. Excellent. <laughs> That for you. Hoy, eh, usted Revés. sería Ana y o John. Y usted, John. How often do you check your email? Every two hours. And you? Well, I... I try to check it as often as I can. And how often do you call your client? I often call them once, once, me dijo, once, once a, week, a week, once a week on Monday. But I usually, uh, but I usually call them on the Friday to check a order. On the no, on Friday. Es que dijo on the Friday, es on Friday. On Friday, ajá, uh -huh. on Friday, to check air order. They, they are, they, they are order, order. They are order. Do you call clients? Do you call clients? Do you call clients? Yes, I always call them first things in the morning. I believe it is important to have contact with them all the time. You are right. Yes, I write. <laughs> <laughs> no está tan difícil. Y sí. las respuestas. How often does Anna check her email? ¿Cómo así? O sea, la, uh, en, en el number three dice, How often does Anna check her email? Oh, ya la voy a ver aquí. Uh, 
No estuve en dos clases. ¿Por qué? Porque estaba un poquito mal de salud. Y la pastilla que me tomaba me noqueaba. Ayer a las ocho y media me dormí. Ah, ah pues sí. Hoy sí. Con razón. Sí. Ah, ya la vi. How often does Anna check a email? Dice de. Her email. Her email. Ya a menudo eh, Ana ¿Con qué revisa. qué frecuencia Ana, revi Ana revisa ah. su, su correo? Cuán a menudo. Uh -huh. Ella revisa su correo. Every two hours. Mm -hmm. okay. What is this important to check the email every day? <coughs> Salud. Gracias. ¿Por qué es importante revisar el email todos los días? Ajá. Good. Bien. Because you have contact with them all the time. Ajá. Ay, señor, creo que me va a dar gripe. Ajá, es que es el tiempo. Es que está haciendo un calor infernal. ¿Cómo me dijo que se pronunciaba ese de all the time? All, ¿es eh, verdad? All the time. All the time. All the time. Y es cold. Call them llamar, once a week. Uh -huh. Call them. Call them and what is the, the other words? Mm, but, but I usually call them on Friday to check their, their order. La otra que era de I but open, open I call, open call the, them once a week. Once, es verdad, once. Once a week, sí. A mí me funciona en el traductor de Google poner las palabras y, y escuchar la pronunciación. Uh -huh. Un compañero me dice que, que busque Elsa. Es una aplicación Elsa. en el teléfono. Uh -huh. Pero Elsa es eh, cierto tiempo gratis y luego es pagada. Pero hay una mejor que se llama... Le voy a decir cómo se llama. Y esa no es. Tiene siete días gratis, pero mmm, no es tan complicada. Se llama Ubus. Uh -huh. ¿Cómo es se escribe? U, U de grande, U, U, S. Ubus. No, Ubus. se llama. No, no, no. Se llama Busu. B, U, S, U, U. B U S U U U U es buenísima porque ahí puede pronunciar hace estrabo eh, como cómo es que se llaman ejercicios de memoria de de comple con unir una palabra con otra es buenísimo a mí me ha resultado uh -huh. bastante este
Ready. Ready, teacher. Ready. Great. Okay, the first person to practice. Mr. Julio. Hi, teacher. Sorry. Who is your partner? Uh, my partners. Mm -hmm. uh, my partners are Daniel and Daniel. <laughs> so you choose Daniel to practice the conversation. Yes. Which Daniel? Yes, to Daniel. Falta agregar Daniel ahí. <laughs> so, ¿con cuál de los dos Daniels va a participar ahorita? Um, no, pues... Um, a, tenemos uno de los Daniels que hace el papel de, de dos, porque tiene pronunciación, bueno, <laughs> modula, modula la voz para tener... <laughs> uh -huh. Ok, démosle Daniel. All right. Pero, eh, ¿yo soy yo? I am my Ahí está. <laughs> okay. Uh, yo soy John. Uh, how often do you check your email? Every two hours. And you? Well, <laughs> I try to check. Uh, <laughs> well, I try to check it as, of, as often as I can. And how often do you call your clients? I use call them once a week on Monday, but I just call them on Friday to check their order. Do you call clients? Yes, I always I always call them first thing in the morning. I believe it is important to have contact with them all the time. You are right. <laughs> Yeah. Oh my God, he is creative. <laughs> like little viejo. <laughs> you remember. Okay, great. Let's see. From the next one, Miss Evelyn was with Juliana, right? Right. Okay, go ahead. I'm young. How often do you check your mail email? Every two hours. And you? Well, I try to check it as often as I can. And how often do you call your clients? I often call, call, call them once a week on Monday. But I usually call them on Friday, Friday to check air order. Do you call clients? Yes, I always call them first things in the morning. I believe it is important to have contact with them all the time. You are right. Yes. yes. Good. <laughs> All right. Claps for us. Claps yes, for us. Yes, claps. <laughs> Virtual claps. <laughs> okay, Karen, who was your partner? Um, lady. Yes. Who was your partner, Karen? I'm sorry. Um, young. All right, and your partner? Um, I mean, <laughs> I mean. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right, ready? Ready. Go. How often do you check your mail? Every two hours, and you? Well, I try to check it as often as I can. And how often do you call your claim? I often call the oh, one a week on Monday, but I usually call the on Friday to check their order. Do you call credit? Yes, I always call the first thing in the morning. I believe 
is important to have contact with them all the time. You are right. Yeah, you are right. Good. Okay, ¿quién se nos queda? George. George and company. ¿Con quién, teacher? ¿Con quién practicó, George? Con los dos que acaban de hablar. <risa> bueno, tal vez eh, alguien le podría apoyar. Ah, el otro, el otro Daniel, que también lo dejaron sin participation en el otro grupo. Dejo. Good. Yes, Mr. Dejo, that's right. All right, are you ready, George? Yeah. Are you a... young? Okay. How often do you check your mail? Every two hours. And you? Well, I try to check it as often as I can. And how often do you call your client? I often call them once a week on Monday, but I usually call them on Friday to check their order. Do you call clients? Yes, I, I always call the first thing in the morning. I believe it is important, important to have contact with them all the time. You're right. Okay, I believe it is important to have contact with them all the time. ¿Hay algo que les haya llamado la atención de esta conversation? ¿Alguna expresión o algo que quieran? Que discutamos. Anything. No se le hace todo very familiar, very easy. Super easy. Easy. Okay. I call them first thing in the morning. ¿Cómo interpretarían eso? ¿Cómo? I call. I call them. Casi la última parte. Yes. Ah, la sí. uh -huh. Escojan la interpretación. Uh -huh. eh, I always si call them first thing in the morning. Lo llamo. ¿Dónde uh -huh. estaba? I usually call them uh, on Friday. Uh, Al final, John. I always no, call yeah, them I... first thing in the morning. Yeah. Eh, siempre lo llamo. Uh, no. Sí, la primera, bueno, es como que si lo primero, siempre, lo primero que hago por la mañana es llamarlos, algo así. Uh -huh. por ahí, no sé. Exacto. Yo siempre los llamo a primera hora. A primera hora de la tarde? mañana. Ajá, exacto, eso es lo que uno dice a primera hora. So, first thing in the morning, eso es lo primero que hago en la mañana. So, a primera hora. Yes. Ok, great. No more questions. Resolvieron las, las questions. How often does Anne check her email? Yes. Mm -hmm. The answer? Um, question one. How often does mm -hmm. Anne check her mm -hmm. email? Mm -hmm. Everything works. Okay. She checks her emails every two hours. Every two hours. Yes, she checks her email every two hours. Yes. And why is it important to check the email every day? It helps us to inform it during the work day. Mm -hmm. Because? It's, yes. Uh -huh. yeah. Because? Um... Uh, because it's important to have contact with them all the time. It is important to have contact with them, with the clients all the time. It is important to answer questions. It is important to keep in contact, to check their orders, right? That's right. Great. All right. Acá tienen algunos um, examples de el uso de adverso frequency, of course. 
Este es un cuadro bastante completo, yo diría, porque los que más usamos son como los dos extremos de always and never y el del medio, ¿verdad? De sometimes. Pero aquí también ustedes tienen en su manual, obviamente, la frecuencia que representa cada uno de ellos. Que vamos desde 100% con always. 90% with usually, 80% normally, 70% often, or often, como lo quieran pronunciar, no hay problema, 30% occasionally, 10% seldom, 5% hardly ever, or rarely. Si digo hardly ever, es lo mismo que estoy diciendo rarely, como rara vez, casi nunca. And never, right? Nunca. No. Sí. Acá también es algo muy importante. Déjenme buscar un puntero. Algo muy importante es que el adverb frequency siempre va a ir entre el sujeto y el verbo. I always get up at five o'clock. He usually drives to work. She normally checks her email. I often have breakfast at work. She sometimes uses the microwave. I occasionally work overtime. We seldom take calls at work. He rarely has conferences. I never get late to work. Entonces, vamos a trabajar con estos adverse of frequency. Déjenme, just one second. Quiero compartirles desde la PowerPoint. Wait a minute. Aquí está. Uh -huh. Justamente les había puesto el mismo cuadro porque considero que está muy completo. Dígame, Miss Evelyn. What that mean? Uh, seldom. Seldom es no con mucha frecuencia, o sea, una traducción exacta sería como... ¿Rara vez? Rara vez, como rarely, pero un poquito más frecuente. No tan frecuentemente, dice uno. Ah, ok. Uh -huh. Ocasionalmente, no pero aún menos que ocasionalmente, es como pocas veces. Ah. No tan frecuente. Uh -huh. okay. Eso es seldom. Tenemos el 10% nada más. Thank you, teacher. You're welcome. Bye. Con esto vamos a compartir esta, este cuadro. Obviamente aquí les dan los ejemplos, pero yo les decía... Algo que deben mantener en mente es que el adverb of frequency va en medio entre el subject y el verb. ¿Yes? Vale. Yes. Voy a dar un espacio que para que puedan leerlo, tal cual yo lo estuve haciendo, desde la frequency, el adverb y el example. 100%, always. always. I always get up at 5 o'clock. 90% usually. usually. He usually, usually drives to work. to work. Y así toman turnos. Hasta que todos lo hayan leído. So Sorry. Important. Y luego traten también de crear una oración similar. ¿Yes? Ya no solamente leer los ejemplos que tienen, sino una oración similar, ya sea real o inventada. ¿Yes? Yes. Ok. Vamos a trabajar igual. Voy a hacer un grupo. Déjenme ver. Wait here. There you go.
Una, en serio, una. Y, no, de cada una tal vez no, una. Una, creo. Ajá. Pero, perdón, los porcentajes a qué se refieren. Oh, este, cuando hablamos de, all, de siempre, always es el 100%, ¿verdad? Sí. A, es, a eso se refieren con la frecuencia. Often es un Ajá. 70%, como que en un rango. Ajá. Ah, perfecto. Es como que, ¿qué tanto lo, lo hace? Ajá. Ya. Chévere. Sí. No íbamos a leer, no. Yes. Yes, you begin, Daisy. No, yo acabo de llegar. Lean ustedes primero y de último yo. Le voy a escuchar primero. <risa> Tatiana, por, por favor, right. Tatiana. Tatiana. Daniela. Let's start. Okay. And I always get up at five, uh, five o'clock. He usually drives to work. She normally checks her email. I often have breakfast at work. She sometimes use the microwave. And occasionally, occasionally, as you say, sí. <laughs> I occasionally work overtime. We seldom take calls at work. He rarely has conferences. I never get late to work. Good. Next. Julio. Um, I always get up at five o'clock. Uh, she usually drives to work. Uh, she normally checks her email. I often have breakfast at work. Uh, she sometimes. ¿Cómo se pronuncia ahí? Ocasión. 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 Occasionally, sí. Occasionally. I occasionally work overtime. ¿En 10%? 10%. Eh, no, ¿Cómo se pronuncia esto? 10%. 10%. Seldom. We seldom take calls at work. Mm -hmm. Siguiente. 5%. Early ever. Rarely. Cualquiera de los dos es lo mismo, ¿va? ¿Cuál? He rarely has conference. Conferences. Conferences. He never. Aquí es 0%. Zero. zero. <laughs> Zero percent. Okay, nice. I never get get late to work. I never get I late to work. Get... 
Ahora, ¿quién sigue? Karen. Ok. Frequence. <laughs> en mí, I always write my work. Normal. She normal. I usually. Normal. Camino. But teach it. Walk. I walk. ¿Cómo? Walk. I walk. Work. I usually go to work. Um, I normally... ¿Desayuna? ¿Breakfast? No. Yo no desayuno. <risa> Sería un cero. Ay, cero. No. No. Yeah. I normally finish my goal at Friday. Mm -hmm. Over overtime significa a tiempo, ¿verdad? Overtime. Overtime. Porque dice, hay no. ocasiones. Tiempo, work, como tiempo extra. Time. Overtime es tiempo extra. Oh. Oh. Overtime es tiempo extra. Como uh -huh. o, uh -huh, horas extras. Ajá. Haga más abajo lo, lo de la, lo que está proyectando Daniel, por favor. Son para ver lo que está. Cinco, ¿verdad? Ah, lo de los. Ajá, porque ahí, ahí, ten, ahí teníamos que poner las oraciones, ¿va? Yes. No, sí. para allá. <risa> ya las tenés arriba. Sí. Yo. Solo es de bajar. No. Porque yo. Ahí yo va para, hice, ahí va para bajar. Yo usualmente no está, ahí, está ahí, lo vamos a cambiar. Sí. La segunda me puse: I open get up at 6 o'clock. Alfred es. A menudo. Ajá, algo así. Y sometimes, sometimes have breakfast at work. Algunas veces. Eh, Frecuentemente no sé, es otra. Frecuentemente. Frecuentemente. Uh -huh. En el baño. Ay, Rael, Rareli, work over time. I never drink coffee in the office. Eso es mentira. Okay. <ríe> Eso es mentira. Eso suena a mentiras.
never. I often get to work early. Did it? Never, never, nunca. And I yeah, like often lady. get to work early. Uh, para decir como que llego frecuentemente temprano al trabajo porque no llego siempre. <laughs> often. I This is often, often get to go eating. Oh no, eating. I never arrive. Summertime. I summertime. At some times, I never arrive late. Hit my email. Her aunt. Yeah, the guy is a her. Every. Shut up, Eberta. I hardly. ¿Cómo se pronuncia eso? Hardly. 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 Thank you. 
Hola, tengo las millas, les sí, ok, a ver, a ver, a ver, a ver, a ver, ay, ahora soy mi, no sé, solo una palabra aquí. The music. Okay, uh, la primera. Um, I always take my word very responsibly. Ya le diré, ya le diré. Yo creo que la la busqué y la descargué, pero no me aparece ninguno de los dos. Vamos a ver el historial aquí. Sí, creo que él será. Pero es que me mencionaron dos. Ya le vamos a preguntar a Julio, es el que me, lo, me la recomendó. Ya le vamos a preguntar a Julio. ¿no? Que hay una que era solo para gramática, que era buena, pero la otra que era para, ¿cómo se llama? Para la pronunciación, hasta que lo dijera bien uno, es que le salía bueno. Ah, sí. No le da pase hasta que pronuncie correctamente. Ajá, exacto. Tu domingo le deja pasar los errores. Sí. Van a leer otra vez. Ok. ¿Quién no comienza? Ah, pues sí, era Elsa Speak. Sí, esa Elsa era. Speak. Uh -huh. ¿Usted lee Leemos primero? Cuál, lo, ¿Lo que notamos eh... o lo que estaba en la tabla? No, lo que está en la tabla. No oh, vaya. Always. In... Always. I always. 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 Sí, cierto. Como que no fuera tan testigo. Que... <ríe> Always. <Sí. ríe> always. I always get up at five o'clock. Una en una, vamos, si quiere. Yo voy a una, una okay. en otra y Karen que menciona. Next garden. Usually. He usually did no. He usually tries to work. Usually. He usually tries to work. She normally checks her email. I often have breakfast. At work. Sometimes. She sometimes. She sometimes. Use the microwave. 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 What is microwave? Microwave. Microondas. Ah. <laughs> okay. Okay. Um. Occasionally, I occasionally work overtime. Seldom. We seldom take calls at work. Occasionally. I occasionally work overtime. Hardly ever and rarely. He rarely has conferences. Never, never. I never get late. Get late to work. 
No es que usted se pasó de, de rarely a occasionally y esa ya la había dicho yo. Ah, te acabo de No, no, no. Eh, vaya, ahora, ahora las oraciones que hicimos en el, en el cuadrito de abajo con always, often, sometime, hardly ever, and never. <risa> Sí. <risa> ok. Todo claro, ¿verdad? Sí. Ok. ¿You finish? Finish. Yes. All right, no problems. Did you finish the sentences? ¿Escribieron una oración con cada uno de los adverbs of frequency? Yes. Fíjese, hay five. Five. <risa> ok. Es que el cuadrito. El del Ajá, cuadrito. Sí, el que les presentaba abajo. Ajá. ¿Cuáles hacían falta? Me falta usually, el de usually, usually, normally, 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 occasional, occasionally, 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 Sí. Bueno, we almost finished. Let's go to the main section, all right? Okay, thank you. Okay. Nos vemos. Vemos. No regresan a unos otros partners. Adelie, Daniel. Just Daniel. Daniel is rarely late. <laughs> He's rarely late. <laughs> okay. Vaya, por cuestión de tiempo no los vamos a escuchar a todos, pero algunos ejemplos, ¿right? Digamos, de los que aún no hemos participado. Sí, teacher. Ok, go. Ok. I always brush my teeth. He usually drinks soda at work. She normally checks her messenger. I often have dinner at work. Dinner at work. Invent. <laughs> you know, I have to have dinner at work. I say, wow. <laughs> Lunch, probably. Mm -hmm. She sometimes uses the computer. Uses the computer. Mm -hmm. Uses the computer. Mm -hmm. I occasionally clean my workspace. We seldom write reports. We seldom write reports. Uh -huh. He rarely dances. He rarely in the dances work. at work. Uh -huh. Dances in the work. I never drink coffee. Yes. Good. Very good. Next. Next, next, next. Me. Go. <laughs> go, go, go. I always see the series at night. Mm -hmm. I often take a shower at six o'clock. I sometimes have a break in the office. Mm -hmm. I hardly ever visit at the museum. Mm -hmm. I never eat a fish because I don't like it. <laughs> I never eat fish because I don't like it. Never, never, All never. Right, good. <laughs> Next. I always like music. I often share an Instagram and sometimes live after the hands. I hardly ever lay. I never miss work. I usually go shopping on Saturday and sometimes for the cake. 
Yay! Good. Next. Me. Yay! Or do I get at a six or seven? Mm -hmm. I often get to work eight, at eight thirty. I summertime check my email. Mm -hmm. I hurry every be bath bathrobe. Desayuno. Uh, I hardly ever eat breakfast. Uh -huh. Okay. I never drink coffee at work. You never drink coffee at work. All right. The claps. <laughs> okay, good. Next, next, next. Who's next? Nobody. Done. Ya todos pasando. Okay. Ya todos pasando. Really? Okay. Yes, yeah, practically it says lo mismo. It's just the same. It's just practicing the adverse of frequency. ¿Cómo, cómo hacemos? La pregunta para saber con qué frecuencia alguien hace algo. How often? How often do you? Y la actividad que queremos preguntar, ¿verdad? How often do you go to the museum? How often do you drink coffee at work? How often do you check your email? Right. Y al responder, obviamente, tener el cuidado de usar el adverb of frequency justamente en medio, entre el subject mm -hmm. y el verb, right? Right. Okay, alguna otra question, duda, doubt, hesitation about the adverb of frequency? No? no. Sure? No. Sure. Bye. De las personas que estamos acá, mm, quiero ver, uy, Brenda tiene ratito de no conectarse, ¿verdad? Daniel, ya terminó la plataforma. Daniel, Daniel, ambos. Daniel, Daniela, Daisy, Tatiana, ayer estuvo. Dolores. The platform. No. <ríe> ¿Qué le ha pasado? Falta Dolores. Liliana. Jonas. Um, Dolores está en reunión. Oh, really? She's in a meeting. Yes. Thank you. Bueno, le vamos a poner ahí el, el reminder. Uy, Dolores, I'm sorry. Después de, de la miren de la auditoría, la, la plataforma. Ay, no, la cereza del pastel. The cherry of the cake. Okay. I'm in a meeting. Sorry. I hadn't seen it. Okay. Bueno. No more questions? That's no all? No more questions, teacher. Bye. That's all. I'm going to pass the attendance bus. Please. Thank you. Let's see. I'm tired. I know. <laughs> Ana Ruth. Not here. Oh my God. Wait a second. Brenda, not here. Claudia, not here. Bueno, Claudia nunca ha estado, la verdad. No la conocen. Claudia. Mm -mm. Okay. Sí, la verdad es que sí se conectó una sola vez, creo. Daniel Trejo. Present. Daniel Reyes. Estoy. Daniela. Present. Daisy, Tatiana. Oh, no, Daisy. No. Not today, pero no pudo. Dolores in a meeting. No, aquí estoy, Daisy, Tatiana. Really? <risa> ayer era que sales. No, ¿cuándo fue? No, ayer sí estuve, antier, que no había internet. Really? 
I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. But the local name Brian. Vamos. Juliana está Present. por ahí. Yes. Jonas dice que está enfermo. George. Que quiero ser abriendo. Julio. I'm here, teacher. Thank you, Karen. I'm here. All right, true. Kevin, Alexander. No estuvo hoy. Qué raro. Lady. And Miss Evelyn. Present. All right. Present. Perfect. <laughs> Ayer, ¿quién nos acompañó? Fue Daniela. True. Entonces, ahora sería Daisy Tapiana. Okay. Uh. <laughs> okay, right on time. Okay, great. All right. Time to sleep. Time to rest. Yes, I'm ready. Thank you. Put your pajamas on. No, me está haciendo un calor. Qué <laughs> No detalles, no details, please. <laughs> Too much information, TMI. See you tomorrow. Be careful. See you Bye. tomorrow, teacher. Very blessing. See you, everybody. Good night, teacher. Good night. Good night. Good night. Tatiana, hello, <laughs> llegando del trabajo, va Tati, getting from work, perdón, pensé que te, <laughs> <laughs> sí, yo dije, no me quiere hablar, <laughs> no. ahorita va llegando, eh, no, a las nueve en punto me conecté que venía llegando, oh, yeah. Very late. Hola. Sí, para llegar del trabajo es como bien tarde. Sí, como ¿Qué? estamos en cierre. Sí, sí ¿verdad? Sí. ¿Y qué tal? Bien, bien, gracias a Dios. Sí. ¿Qué tal ha sentido la carga académica de este curso? Pues a mí me cuesta bastante. Sí, ¿verdad? Sí, me cuesta. Y apenas me estuve. <ríe> me intento acoplar a mis compañeritos que sí pueden pasar. Pero ya se los puede. Sí, sí, sí. Bastante se me los puede. Bye. Así que apóyese con ellos para que le, le den ahí. Veo que le hace falta en la plataforma, Tati. Sí, ahorita lo voy a terminar. <ríe> ahorita, desde que me llame la atención. <ríe> lo iba a hacer en la hora del trabajo, pero no se me escapó. No se puede. Y justamente de eso estuvimos hablando al inicio de la clase, de las cosas que uno avanza en el trabajo, <ríe> sin que lo cachen. Sí, sí, sí. Pero solo me faltan las de el sí, lunes. Ajá, yo veo que tiene un porcentaje, pero que aún no llega al, al 100%. Sí, ajá, 40. Bueno. ¿Alguna duda o algo con lo que te gustaría que le apoye? No, realmente a mí me gusta cómo está dando la clase. Sí me parece que, o sea, que estamos en el módulo 2, ¿verdad? Que usted se está comprando, lo único que hay compañeros que pueden más. Sí, Pero yo sí considero que, que lo que usted está explicando sí es de, o sea, para nosotros, ¿verdad? que apenas uh -huh. estamos pues, ahí arrancando. Sí. De ahí quizás por lo demás, este... Eh, en las reuniones, que siento que cuando nos reunimos en grupo, que a veces nos sobra bastante tiempo. Sí, pero... ajá, porque hay unos que son como muy rápidos, pero estoy en un grupo que ya están apenas empezando. Y yo digo, ay, si ahorita lo saco, no van ah. a hacer nada. Sí, me suele pasar, igual ya me había percatado. Sí. Vaya, no llego a la. A... Lo que pasa es que como a veces como que uno no sabe cuánto tiempo. ¿ve? Entonces ah, uno trata de terminar rapidito, pero después nos sobra. Ah, para que practique. <risa> sí, eso, eso sí. No, no logró practicar esa conversación aún. Eh, sí, sí, sí. Sí, la logró practicar. A eso entré cuando estaban practicando eso, que estaban diciendo que eh, lo de John, que si lográbamos interpretar. Mm, Yo estaba ahí. Cuando... Ok, perfecto. Muy bien, pues sí, 
No, no es que sí es un on-time. Vaya, si quiere la escucho. La leo. Uh -huh. Bueno, solo la voy a hacer más grande. Ok. How often do you check your email? Every two, every two hours. And you? Well, I try to check it as often as I can. And how often do you call your clients? I often call them once a week on Monday, but I usually call them on Friday to check their order. Do you call, call claims? Claims. Clients? Clients. Clients. Mm -hmm. Yes, I always call them first then in the morning. I believe it is important to have con contact with them all the time. You are right. No, a mí me cuesta bastante. <risa> no, vaya, vuelve a practicar. Yo la estoy escuchando, solo que voy a ir a conectarla, a desconectar, perdón, la laptop. Go, go. Okay. How often do you check your email? Every two, every two hours. And you? Well, I try to check it as often as I can. And who often do you call your clients? clients? Clients. Your clients? I often call them once a week on, the mo on Monday, but I usually call them on Friday to check their order. Do you call clients? Yes. I, I always call them first thing in the morning. I believe it is important to have contact with them all the time. You are right. You are right. Okay, vamos a como a, a decir algunas palabritas que... Pero aquí está no el highlight que ando buscando. <laughs> <risa> draw, 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 draw. Qué feo. Aquí solía tener yo un highlighter, pero no lo encuentro. Bueno, lo vamos a hacer con este. Mira, que quería, pero es lo que hay. Ajá. How. How. How often. How often. How often do you check your email? How often do you check your email? Mm -hmm. How often do you check your email? Exacto, es como de corrido, ¿verdad? <ríe> Porque es una sola pregunta. Every two hours. Every two hours. Mm -hmm. Well, I try to check it. Eso es como una... Ya me lo voy a regresar esto que... Okay. I try to check it así todo junto. I try to check it. I try to check it as often as I can. As often as I can. And how often do you call? Call es como una o. How often do you call? How often do you call your clients? Your clients. Okay. I often call them. Esto como también si fuera una sola cosa. I often call them. I often call them. Once a week. Once a week. On Monday. On Monday. But I usually call them. But I usually call them. On Friday. Call them. Como le llamo a ellos. Pues. Entonces unido. Call them. Call them. On Friday. On Friday to check their order. To check the order. Mm -hmm. Do you call clients? Do you call clients? Yes. I call them first thing in the morning. Esto sí casi como que una sola idea. I call them first thing in the morning. 
I always call them first thing. Call them first thing. Okay. Call them first thing in the morning. Okay. Espérame, le voy a cambiar el color por esta. First thing. Esta es como una Z. First thing in the morning. First, first thing. 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 First thing. <laughs> Call them first thing in the morning. Thing. Mm -hmm. I believe it is important. Important. I believe it's important. Mm -hmm. It is important to contact, oh, sorry, to have contact with them all the time. To have contact with them all the time. You're right. <laughs> <laughs> you are right. You are right. Exactly. Sí, a veces es como tomarse nada más el tiempo, ¿verdad? Como de estar enfatizando la palabrita por palabrita ya al leerlo de corrido se escucha mejor. Sí, sí bastante. Bastante mejor. Okay. Bueno, eso sería para ti. Tranquila. Do the platform. <laughs> Porque si no a mí me van a llamar. Porque soy estudiante de la plataforma. No, ahorita no tenemos. Bueno, pues, good luck. See you tomorrow. Good night. Good night.